A slice of Americana comes to the Reading Public Museum. Hi, thanks for joining us. I'm your host, Autumn Marisa, and you're watching Comcast Newsmakers. Joining me is Scott Schweiker, the Curator of Art and Civilization at the Reading Public Museum. Thanks for being here today, Scott. Sure, thanks, Autumn. Tell us about this upcoming exhibit. Well, it's uh, a show that comes to us from the Norman Rockwell Museum in Stockbridge, Massachusetts. Uh, it's a traveling exhibition, uh, but we are the only venue in the United States uh, to which it's traveling. So wow. it's an exclusive for us, which is ex super exciting. Um, and it's a show of about 70 plus works uh, that span Rockwell's career uh, with the Boy Scouts from the 19 teens through about the 1960s. So it's sort of a comprehensive look at his treatment of uh, the subject of scouts and scouting in the United States. Talk a little bit about that relationship he has along background right with them. right well he started out illustrating boys life uh, early on around 1912 and then by 1914 he was uh, named art editor of the magazine at a very young age uh, but he was quickly lured away by other magazines the Saturday Evening Post and others so but he kept a relationship uh, he maintained a relationship with the organization uh, he did uh, calendars for about 51 years for the Scouts and did the cover of boys life in the February issue for about 50 or 60 years as well so it's a very long span of his career I mean obviously uh, Rockwell is an icon of American Absolutely. art he's a household name everybody's familiar with his images so I think we think that this will be a great show for uh, for folks to come especially those who haven't been to see us lately who is it um, going to attract what, what kind well of I think crowd? right scouting groups obviously uh, so lots of local troops uh, are coming um, school groups as well um, there's a lot of opportunity to talk about American history. There's World War One and World War Two, um, you know, sort of as as the background. Um, and there's also a section on presidents. Um, because the president of the United States is also the honorary president of the Boy Scouts. So uh, there's that tie-in as well. So we've got a lot to offer in this exhibition. And you have some side exhibits as well. Can you explain those? Right. We've got a show called Scouting Through the Years, which is in our central gallery that runs concurrent with this show. Um, and that is uh, objects from the 19-teens through present day. Uh, it's things like uniforms and handbooks and badges and those sorts of things. And we also have a works on paper show which features Norman Rockwell and scouting as a theme as well. Is there an additional fee to see this? No, you can, um, it's included with admission to the museum, so um, so it's it's a great, uh, again, a great opportunity to visit us if you haven't seen us. And anymore. what attracted the museum to this exhibit? Well, we thought two things. Uh, it, it's sort of a win-win situation. Scouting is a popular subject, and Norman Rockwell, as, a, as an artist name, um, is something that we think that that will resonate with a, with a lot of our audience. So sure. it was sort of a match made in heaven sure. uh, to have these two things combined in one show. And how long is the show going to run? The show is up through January of 2014. So you have an opportunity to see it now till then. Yes. Okay. And talk a little bit about um, the the museum in general. What else we can be expecting to see? Sure, absolutely. Year? The fall has a lot of uh, activity. Um, we're we're rolling out uh, exhibitions. We have a, a modern and contemporary show on the second floor. We have a show of recycled fashion uh, running concurrently with these shows as well so there's sort of something for everybody we're really excited about the fall season and hope that hope that you're you know the pe folks can visit us great and if somebody would like to find out more information how can they do that go to the website is probably the best uh, the best advice and that's uh, www.readingpublicmuseum.org great thank you so much Scott this hour's newsmaker has been Scott Schweikert he's the curator at the uh, at the Reading Public Museum you've been watching Comcast Newsmakers I'm Autumn Marisa we'll see you next time